To get started with your Turn 14 distribution app, enter your client ID in secret. If you don't have them, you'll need to contact Turn 14. If your account is valid, you'll get a success message. First, pick the brands you want in your store. Basic Shopify accounts are only allowed 50,000 products before Shopify slows down the loading speed, so be selective. Speed isn't an issue if you have an Advanced or Shopify Plus plan. If your store focuses on a specific kind of vehicle, this is where you can filter by make, model, submodel, and years. By default, your Turn 14 distribution app doesn't bring in products that have a stock level of zero, even if you have selected them. All of these are by default unselected, so check the box if you want them in your store. By default, your app will bring in every category. However, sometimes you will want to bring in just specific categories of parts. Check Include only these categories, and then choose body armor, bumpers, whatever you want in your store. In your store admin, you can see every possible collection, but they will not be visible in your store unless you've enabled them in your store theme. Fitment buckets are dynamic categories based on fitment. We can use the fitment data to create collections in your store. For example, 2010 to 2015 Ford F-150. This is ideal for mobile shoppers who find it easier to click on buttons or categories instead of using a classic year make model search. You can even use fitment buckets to set up mini stores around certain makes of vehicles. Often you want to sell at minimum advertised price, but if the product doesn't have a map price, then your app will look for manufacturer suggested retail price. If neither map nor MSRP are available for that part, then whatever margin percentage you assign will be added to the wholesale cost. You can add whatever margin you like to the base cost for all the products in your store. The app will always increase the price to the map if the calculated margin is lower. And you can add whatever margin you like to the MSRP. Select this option if you don't want the products in your store to be marked up at all, or if you have your own pricing already built into your products. You can choose to have no price decoration, or for one of these amounts to be automatically added to the end of each price. You've also got the option to offer free shipping and checkout, or check if you prefer to add shipping costs based on other criteria. You can choose between minimum, average, and maximum estimated shipping cost, which is calculated by Turn 14 distribution. Check this if you want to make a profit off shipping. You may want to choose this because Turn 14's shipping rates are very competitive. Data here to there can connect a wide variety of systems. Fitment Search allows your customers to find parts by year, make, and model. Fitment data can be imported into your store using any of these plugins. Use the Content section to customize your product pages. These all represent content and synchronizations that can be checked on or off. Click here to check your store's synchronization status. You can click on any of the blue text to see further information about which products are being added or removed. Use the status to get an overview of which brands have been loaded, filtered out due to special order process, or any of a number of other reasons, like name mismatches, missing images, and so on. If you click on the main help button, you'll see the entire manual. Each of the help buttons associated with the individual sections of this manual will show you the same information but pertaining to just that section of the app. 